Alright, what's going on guys? Macho Killer here, and today I finally got my Sony Vegas, like, for the last three days I didn't have it, and I finally got it back, so I'm, uh, recording another video, and today we are gonna be recording some Durees right here. I got all the maps, uh, I'm choosing Durees because I'm gonna be playing the Giants whenever it comes out, which is six days left, I cannot wait for it. You guys, like, you guys don't understand. I can't wait for the giant. Even says the giant is rising. Face the might of the Nazi zombies in their heart. Heartland? That makes sense. Alright, so, it even says the giant right there. Like, I never knew that Doris meant giant. Or the giant meant Doris or anything like that. <clears throat> until Black Ops 3 came up with giant. So, either way, we're going to be playing it because I want to get used to playing it. Like, where all the... Right? Oh, okay, I thought my PSD first. You know, where all the guns... Uh, just get used to playing the map, really. Because I don't want to play the Giant and, like, go to round two when it... The first time playing it. So, I'm gonna practice by myself. And, uh... Yeah. Ooh, here we go, boy. Yeah. Ooh, we're Rick Toffin. Perfect. Girl, I'm gonna skip my mic. There we go. Alright, guys. See what we got here. Guys, by the way, I'm going to be recording the launch of Black Ops 3 with Facecam. So, uh, yeah. That'll be a good video. To Whenever the launch of Black Ops 3 comes out, I'll be having the Facecam and everything. And by the way, guys, I already downloaded Black Ops 3, which I'll just show you guys right now. So yeah, I already downloaded it, so uh, whenever the game comes out, I'm going to be recording some zombies. I got lucky. It said if I wanted to choose zombies, multiplayer, or campaign. I didn't really think of anything, so I just picked zombies because I already played the multiplayer. And, uh, I mean, I'm not saying, like, if I press zombies, I can't play multiplayer at all. It's just, like, I can't download multiplayer until the actual game comes out, which kind of sucks. I didn't even know that either, like, until zombies was done downloading. So if I would have picked multiplayer, I would have been screwed because I would have had to spend most of my time in the day downloading it in zombies, really, which would be stupid. So I haven't bought the giant yet, but I'm buying it today, and I cannot wait, guys, to play the giant. It looks so sick. It looks like it's also snowing either. I'm not sure if that's like an effect, like to make the trailer look better or something, but it looks like it's snowing. But uh, overall, the map looks freaking awesome. Especially that we're going to be playing as the characters again. We haven't played any of, like, the characters since, like, BO2 Origins. And that was, like, a, a really long time ago. So, good thing they're coming out with that. And, uh, I, was just, I spent, like, almost an hour just watching, like, the zombie storyline. And it was just freaking awesome, like, to hear all that kind of stuff. Especially that, uh, most of it's, like, connected to the Black Ops 3, like, the trailer and stuff like that. Or not really the trailers, but the Black Ops 3 zombie story. Like, it's all connected with the Black Ops 1 and 2 already. And guys, by the way, I'm now recording in 60 frames now. Which is, like, a lot better. I don't know if it'll be, like, perfect 60 frames on this map. Because some of it's kind of laggy in some places. But, whatever. And guys, we are, like, super close to 50 subs. And that's just awesome. I've been wanting to live stream forever. But, like, my Elgato won't let me for some reason. So, I'm gonna try to use OBS to live stream the launch of Black Ops 3. I've been trying to... Like, you can connect OBS and the Elgato together, so I can live stream my console. But I'm trying to figure out, like, I know how to link it, but then, like, it says blah blah blah, you did not enter this code in, or blah blah blah. I'm like, okay. I didn't say anything about that. OBS has recently updated, and all the tutorial videos are, like, on the old update, which sucks. Guys, by the way, after, like, I play, like, a bunch of zombies on the weekend, me and my friend are just gonna 1v1 on Black Ops. 2065 if you guys haven't seen the trailer for it go check it out it's freaking awesome it looks amazing especially like the wall running parts like i thought it was gonna be like a different looking nuke town i thought it was gonna be like a different design of it but it's actually the same design just like looks different which i'm glad i was a little worried that was gonna be like a total different nuke town but nah nah it's good it's good i had to change a lot because like since you can Double jump, like you have to make the walls higher and for the wall running too. Oh, what? 
I don't. I can't say anything, guys. We'll just. Oh my god. All right, guys. I forgot to outro this video. Uh, cause I was just so mad. I completely forgot. But there was one thing I wanted to show you guys, and it was this. Yeah, the freaking ray gun is on the giants and the shadows of evil. We don't know anything about the ray gun mark two or three. We don't even know if there is a three. <clears throat> but there also is perks on the shadows of evil for sure because I have some gameplay. But I don't want to put it in the description or in the video because I feel like it would be uh taken down or something like that. So uh yeah, that was a little Easter egg I found out. And I just want to show you guys really quick. So, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, everybody.